Hi everyone, today we'll talk about the different coupling modes of the oscilloscope. So first off, right here I've got a oscilloscope set up with a signal uh, generator inputting a 1K square waveform. As you can see on the um, display. And I've got channel 1 turned on. So to access the different coupling points, first we need to consider the menu. So to introduce the menu, by pressing um, channel 1 once, so that comes up and go down to coupling, press that once, turn this knob to select which one you want and then press it in. This button here with menu on and off will turn on or off the previous menu you've accessed. And so first off, we've got it on DC coupling and this is signified here on the very bottom of the screen. So that's on DC. So DC allows you to see different offsets. So I've got an uh, offset pulled out on the uh, signal generator. So if I twist this up and I introduce a voltage offset, um, the wave will move up or down and the ground will st stay stationary. So this allows you to see the offset. If I change this to AC, coupling, twist it once, press it in, and I twist the offset again, and I'll close up the menu. So adjusting the offset won't do anything to the waveform, as it's simply removing off the DC component. So AC coupling is most used when um, you're observing a time varying small signal with a large DC offset and it allows you to observe uh, the time varying part of the waveform. And as you can see, the AC is indicated on the bottom next to channel 1. The third form of um, coupling is ground. So press that once and select ground. This gives you the line that shows you what ground is. This is also indicated by the arrow. Just keep in mind that in most situations you'll be using DC coupling over AC.